Kirinyaga Governor Anne Wainguru used her State of the County address to rally support for the BBI Constitutional Amendment Bill. Wainguru said that the changes proposed by the BBI will help diffuse volatile ethnic politics, spur equitable development, and help the fight against corruption. Wainguru said Kirinyaga County should be the first to pass the BBI bill, having been the first to dismiss the Punguza Mzigo bill. Waiguru Guru defended her development record during her time in office. As a county, we stand to benefit in many ways from the BBI proposals. Firstly, the allocation to counties will increase from the current 15% to 35%. In Kirinyaga, we will receive an increment in our equitable share allocation from the current 4 billion to 8 billion shilling. This amount will enable us to realize enormous development for our people and reduce dependency on the national government. Second, the provision of a minimum 5% allocation towards World Development Fund in Kirinyaga will guarantee at least 400 million to every ward every year. So to say, Mayala Yote, I'm a Semas Quileo, Tama Tawesa Committee Nisa, Akuta Kuana Shida Tena County at Kirinyaga, Hila Shinda Iquia Konukovilesa to Kua to Kirekea Pandemoja to Kirekea Panda Iquana Ekrai, Nakini Kovira, Mesema Yota, Tatinisa Sasta Kua to Kenda Pandemoja. Sikuileo, Mayala Yotopa Metuma, Nimeyunga. Mukono, lakini vijambo ni kumambia atimiza hiyo. Atimiza hiyo.